Hey guys, it's Dave and I am really very sorry for light uploading this review. This is New Avengers issue number 28. Last week it's just released. I should have uploaded this review last week. Here we go. Without wasting any much time, I'm gonna do and I'm gonna read this review of this amazing issue. Oh, what just happened? Anyway, I'm gonna do a review from GeekedOutNation.com and it's written by John Tupin. The main plot of Jonathan Hickman's New Avengers 28 You Can't Win Part 2 revolves around a show of forces from the two opposing sides of Reed Richards Illuminati and Steve Rogers Shield. Roberto is the perfect fall. Hickman's characterization of him is perfectly representative of what I would imagine an adult Roberto to be. It is a shame that the story's form framing has Tony Stark out of action because these two characters could not be any more similar. Seeing Roberto and Tony clash would be very cool. Part 1 of you can't win in Avengers 37 ended with the Illuminati revealing their hand in the form of a new Avengers squad, giving them an edge against the Steve Rogers side. New Avengers 28 opens with Roberto da Costa's new Avengers squad dictating an ultimatum to Steve Rogers. That's a kind of a really bit of thing because highly recommended by Chuck. Chuck's comic of the book Coming of the day, he has recommended this one. But after reading some pages, I became to get bored. But after that, it became really interesting uh, because the artwork overall is have a theme, and it also contains and constantly endures and uh, what should I say? Constantly keep its its whole package of artistic artwork expression and uh, what is this thing the colors and everything that's why it looks pretty great and the style is almost same all over the comics that's why the consistency is there without spoilers this issue plays out with each side battling and taking it in turns to play their hands and up the stakes of the flight we think the Illuminati have the upper hand before Steve Rogers reveals a secret weapon to which the Illuminati react by revealing a secret weapon and so on a couple more times until the issue end. There were rumors a while back that circulated during the original scene times about Marvel preparing for a second civil war without actually using the title. This is as close as they will ever come. The central port of New Avengers 28 is a huge scale battle between two opposing Avengers sides, each of whom is convinced they are the ones fighting the right side of the battle. All of this is captured beautifully by the art of Mike Dodato and Mike Perkins. The panel arrangement is cinematic in its execution. That's why I always like this kind of cinematic kind of way of storyboarding, none more so than when two hulks are going toe to toe, one being dimension displaced from the early Avengers world storyline. I say this about every Hickman Avengers book at this point, but it does always need saying. New Avengers 28 is so deep in ongoing story that it won't be uh, satisfying a read to someone getting into the series. Frank Martin's colors add a professional and dramatic finish. Being a core title Marvel can afford high tire talent, so no less than the best should be expected. New Avengers 28 has a definitive sheen of quality in its production. The only downside to the art is in some of the characters' faces, somewhere between the combination of Deodato and art and merchants coloring the faces of certain characters are left looking waxy at times early on in his run hickman's two titles remain separate by their focus on different squads it's a testament to his skill that despite the books now being entirely dependent on each other that they manage to keep the focus on their respective teams i really like when that they didn't mix the new avengers with the axis series because axis events looks kind of dull for me at the ending situation it kind of a whole lot of messed up and i thought that they wanted to anyhow finish it wanted to finish it that's why they finished it in the issue number nine avengers and x-men and the times also so i am really happy they didn't mix it with this new avengers series and hope you guys have enjoyed if you like it then don't forget to like don't forget to hit the like button and share it and just enjoy the comics buy it at the comic store it will help the creators and it will help you to get entertained every time